In today's video, we're playing some 2v2s pushing to get back up to SSL. And you already know what it is. If you guys saw yesterday's video, I was using the Bumblebee. I'm doing it again today. Uh, I was lucky enough to get gifted this by Epic Games. So no, I did not pay for this. And this is a sponsored video. But if you guys want to get this for yourself, make sure to go to the item shop. Use code COCORL. And then uh, you can get the bundle. You get just the goal explosion, just the car, or just the theme. Up to you guys. But uh, yeah, if you guys do do it, do do. Make sure you use my creator code. It really does help me out. I'll see you on game number one. All right, getting into game number one. We got Ramen playing up against Nexity and Xenum. Uh, this will be an interesting game. Nexity's a very, very high level player. Uh, I'm going to try to just force this for my teammate. Did force him high. Nice. That's a good challenge from him. Well, I was going to play on the soft touch, but... Oh, I got bumped. Oh, my God. Right, that works. I got no boost now, though. Oh, Rama can actually go for that, I think. I kind of gave that to him. Hopefully he can't get a double. I'm just going to blind jump. I should not have jumped. Should have just sat on the ground. My bad. My bad. I meant to, like... I don't know. I probably should have just caught that instead of trying to flick it up high. But honestly, I had no idea where Xenom was. And I assumed that he was going to be challenging the ball rather than getting the boost. Bang. Close. Maybe he can follow that. I'll try to get a demo on one of them. That might be a goal. I don't know where, where Ramen is. Oh, nice. Good save. Try to hit that around him. Uh, I was going to try to get a, like, a little sneaky touch there. And maybe he thought, oh, man, he messed up. He's not going to go for the ball again. And then I just go for the ball again. Let me go for a sidewall here. Nice. Good sidewall. Gets the ball forward. But unfortunately, Ramen's not really going to be able to catch up to that. I'm going to try to hit that up high. Maybe just get a demo on Nexity. Can't do it. Get a bump on him. Rama can go now. I'll go behind him here because next he could have a shot if he gets a good one. Right, I'm going to go up to the ceiling with this. Should be a free goal. Nice. Good shot from us. Good shot. He like pre-jumped me, so as soon as I go high there, it just kind of destroys him. Uh, that's a, That was actually really nice, though. I did not expect to actually be able to like reach that. You know, Once I saw it hitting off the... Oh, man. That sucks, because that would have been a nice ball to follow up on, too. Okay, Xenon's going to be on that. Got a fake. Nice. Good cut from Ramen. I'll go for another sidewall here. Now, just shoot that on. Nice. Force them to double commit. So, if Ramen can get the ball over Nexity and stay on it, we should actually be in a pretty good spot. I'm not close enough to actually follow that up. Okay. Got a fake. Right on Xenon. Good 50. Watch for the bump. I was going to say, I thought he was going to go for that. Good beat from Ramen. Alright. I had to make sure to get that mid boost there to make sure that uh, Nexity was boost starved. Actually, if you notice, then uh, Nexity is stuck on the backboard. Oh my god, that was an open net if I just flipped forward. Uh, I don't know why I flipped to the side there. Maybe I thought it wasn't going to go far enough, but then instead I just, you know, missed the net entirely, so... Shot! Oh my god. Alright, I got the boost from him. I got the boost from him, so he's gonna be awkward here, so I can just challenge this for ramen, you know? Alright. He's not having that. Oh, I thought Xenon was gonna go for a... Go for a bump there. Luckily he didn't. Oh, ramen doubled that. Oh, dude, I had so much faith. Gotta watch for the demo, uh, if Xenon's gonna go for one of those. Nice. Shot! Perfect. Look at that shooting. I'm not gonna lie, the, the shooting on this car, like, if you guys watched my ones video yesterday, you would have known that my shooting was actually really, really rough. But I'm not gonna lie, the shooting on this car actually feels really solid. Like, I don't know, the touches on it in general, like that one sidewall, like the first sidewall of the video that I went for, that touch to the wall just felt like so solid. I'll get that over him. He can take that. I'll try to just stay back here. Good beat from Ramen. I was a little bit worried about that, you know, about like him getting beat and then me not being able to follow up on it or me not being able to get back in time, but nah, I'm dead. Maybe you can just shoot that fast? Nah. Hey, I'll sit that high. Fake that. He can take it over. Nice. I'll just, f oh, he was going to go for the corner. Oh, it's just in the net, I think. Nope, it's not. I shouldn't have talked. All right. Good challenge again there. Just trying to keep up pressure without really committing myself too hard. Uh, try to get them on Xenom here. Okay, game hates me. 
That's, uh, that's nothing new. No, that's a perfect shot. That was a perfect shot. I had the rest of the net covered, literally. I don't know. I swear, like, I skimmed that ball. I had to have, right? Oh, man. Wish I would have known that he just had perfect shooting. I don't think he's going to pre-jump this, so I'll go up for a reset. Over him. Okay, now he used all of his boost, though, so... Ramen should be able to beat Nexity. Nice shot. It's good pressure, though. You know, even though it's not a goal. Hit it out to Ramen. Shot. No. Fake this. Hit that to the side. Oh, that's a good demo. I thought I would, like, maybe he would, like, trip me up or something like that, but... I didn't expect to actually just get demolished there. It's all good, though. Take some pads here. Okay, I got the full boost now. Good challenge for us. Hopefully Ramen can find some big boost. I think he just... Oh, I don't think he got the big boost. Oh, no, that could have been a goal. Ramen, can you go? Maybe? Nah. It's gonna... It's a... That's a tough ass to ask him to get around that ball and then shoot it on net, you know, quickly, too, because if he didn't do it quickly, then they weren't gonna... Or they were gonna be able to cut it off, so... All right, I gotta grab some pads here. They don't just touch. Just gonna hit that in the ground. I want to make sure that they're not gonna be challenging it, right? And so, just hit it in the ground. It's the safest. Okay, go for a fake here. Go over him. Oh, close, close. That's a good idea, though. Get the fake so that the first guy challenges, and then use the flip reset to actually. Um, get the ball, like, speed the ball over the other guy, like, unexpectedly. Maybe Ramen can keep that in. I don't know if he's gonna be able to follow that or not. Nah, Xenom's there. Oh, I bumped him. Is he gonna be able to get back? Probably not. That's just the game. Wow, what a shot from Nexity. That's all good, though. We'll get right into game number two. I'll see you all then. Alright, we got Drav on our team, playing against Nexity again. And Peak. I'm not gonna lie, we definitely could've won that last game. Um... I feel like that one, uh, the one play that Nexity had, like the goal that tied it up for them, that definitely could have been saved by me if I just like read it a little bit better, you know? He's gonna be awkward there, drop can go, and then I'll go on the backboard here. He's soloing it, that's fine. Hit that over Nexity. And then I don't know if he's gonna be able to turn in on that or not, so I'll just play like he isn't going to. I'll just try to air dribble this. You know, it's important that when you can get more than one touch on the ball that you do, because if I just give the ball away there, you know, ooh, close. Now I'm in a 1v1 for a long time, though, unless he's able to get back for me. Nice. Uh, it's important that you get extra touches when you can, right? Because if I were to just have given the ball away there uh, and, you know, gotten the clear off our backboard, right, then they're going to be able to challenge that ball pretty, pretty, like, towards the midfield, right? But because I was getting those extra touches, that's an open net drop. Very nice. Because I was getting those extra touches, I'm able to uh, prevent them from going for the ball until it's like well within their half. So that gives my teammate a little bit of extra time. Uh, and that gives, you know, that gives me a little bit of extra time to get some boost as well. So that's, uh, it's important to just, you know, kind of keep the ball in your possession as long as possible. Even if your possession just includes like 50ing the ball, right? It's important to do that. I'm gonna wait on Shrav here. He's gonna have that. I did want to wave dash to like stay on the ball there. I'm gonna fake this because next he's gonna have a shot. Hopefully he can get a bump. No! Oh yeah, he can't get fakes there. No problem. No problem. Alright. I'll try to take this full boost here. Wait on Drav. Next, he's gonna have that. Nice. Maybe he can stay on that. Wait on Peak. Next, he's gonna take that. Oh, I got nothing. Drav, go fast. Thank you. Try to just put that on target, or at least close to target. Maybe make him a little bit awkward. Uh, wasn't necessarily sure if I was gonna be able to get. An actual good shot there but you know if i just touch it hard enough towards the backboard then sometimes that'll be enough to just make them panic right get a double here <gasps> i actually was in the right spot for that and i didn't trust myself i got like the perfect touch to follow that up for a double and i just did not trust myself 
I can stay on this. I got no boost. I got no boost. I got no boost. Thank you, Drive. Hopefully, you can stay on that. Get the mid boost. I think Peak got it. I think he actually bumped Peak into it, which is unlucky. Okay, he's got that. Wait on Drive. Good shot. Wait on this touch here. Nice. Good from Drive. Trying to get a demo. He can't get that. Um. On him, good 50. Gotta go up for a double there. Wanted to go for the double tap, but uh, it just wasn't wasn't fast enough to go for that. Plus, I think next he would have had it cut off either way. Maybe just hit that towards him. He can go for a double, I think. That was a good read from Peak. Right on him. Try to hit that far. All right, nice. Next, he got a touch, but it's just very awkward for them. I should be able to control this. I wish I had a hundred boost. There it is. Try to get a fifty. Couldn't do it. Um, if I had if I had gotten the reset a little bit closer to the ball there, I might have been able to get a really good musty flick in the net, but unfortunately, it just wasn't able to happen. Hopefully, Drive can take that, get a touch of. I don't know if I'm in love with that touch, but it's all right. Oh, I'm in love with that, though. He just 50 to his teammate. We'll take that for sure. Thanks, Drop. That was all me, baby. Good 50 from them. I'll try to cheat up here. Maybe get a bump. Okay. He's going to beat me there. Good on them. Try to demo Nexity. Fake this. All right, I got it. Nice, Drop can take. All the way behind him, full boost. Next, he's gonna be on them. Wait on him. Peak's gonna be on. All right, there's no point in, in jumping or challenging there. Like when I, one, if I know that I'm beat, there's no point in challenging, but also if I know that they're not gonna be able to actually get a good shot on the ball or shot on goal, then there's no point in challenging. You know, I'm trying to get a good demo there. Uh, I got us, Drop. Wait, oh my god, that's gross. That is just disgusting. That is absolutely filthy from Drav there. There's just absolutely no reason that he needs to be going in like that. But he did. But he did. You know? I'm gonna fake, or just cheat up here. Just soft cheat. Don't wanna commit too hard for anything. It actually works out pretty pretty perfectly for us. Get it over him. Peek's gonna be on that with a lot of momentum though, so Drav's gotta recognize that and just decide not to go there. I'm just gonna dive in. Nice. Shot. That's a good save from Nexity. Drop do dove in as well, so hopefully he's able to maybe get a save here. Okay. Touch. Beautiful. That's gonna be the game. Nice. GG. We'll get oh wait, watch this. Am I the MVP? I am the MVP. Look at this. Look at this celebration. Oh, look at that. That's what we'd like to see right there. We'll get right into game number three. I'll see you all then. All right, getting into game number three. We got Silly Sasquatch 54 on our team playing against Dr. Rupert and Hexy. Uh, let's get it. Got that? Oh, he ain't got that. I'll wait on Dr. Rupert here. Fake this. Should be able to take that, though. Then I'll wait on Silly Sasquatch. I'm going to try to stay topped up this game. You know, really work on the boost pad management and collection. That was a really good beat from them. I did not expect Dr. Rupert to be on that so quickly. I was thinking about all the boost pads that I just collected rather than thinking about the ball that was flying over my head, so. Yeah, that's a good touch over him. Uh, but unfortunately, I kind of committed myself with the flip, and I'm dead now. So I can't even do anything to affect the play. Hopefully he's able to... Yeah, it should be a free ball. We're good. I'll wait on him. Okay, yeah, he's awkward there. Let's take this up the wall. Actually, he's challenging that. Should be fine, though. I, don't, I really don't think he can do anything there. Nice. Good challenge for my teammate. I'll play behind him here. Wait on the 50. Try to take this boost. Nice. I'll just try to carry this. Maybe get a 50. Shot. Nice. You know, I have a bunch of different options there. Either I can go into the air dribble and I can just continue dribbling like, like that. Or I can go for the flip reset. Or I can go for the double tap. Or I can go for the 50. And, you know, he has to decide which one of those options are most likely considering where my car is. 
And sometimes you just can't, you know? Sometimes you just can't read it. So that's, that's like the goal is, you know, the reason you want to be able to do a bunch of different shots is so that you can threaten everything. Like if, if they know that you're going to be going for an air dribble every single time, and they know that you're not capable of a flip reset, then they know that all they have to do is cover the high touch, right? So, but if they know that you're capable of an air dribble, of a flip reset, of like everything else, you know, it's going to be a lot more difficult to defend because they have a lot more options they need to cover. Uh, bang! In! Oh, I was really hoping that that would somehow just sneak, sneak its way in. It was a good musty flick, you know. I just touch that soft, close. Maybe you can say on that. I'm not really sure. Went on Doctor Rupert. All right, get it over. He can take that. I'll play behind him here. I got 50 boost. Uh, so hopefully, silly Sasquatch can do some crazy for us. We'll get a little double tap. Nah. Nah, we're good. I'm just gonna force this ball high. All right. Luckily, he just touched it high anyways, but. That should be fine. I mean, I would have liked to control that, but I also probably should have been on the ground to start off with if I did want to control that. And uh, it's fine that I wasn't able to. That's going to be over, so that should be free for him. Nice. Again, that's the reason why you always force the ball high right there. You know, I was challenging the ball. He got the flip reset. And because I was challenging the ball, he knew that if he wanted to get it over me, he had to hit it up high. Right? But as soon as he hits it up high, it's just a free ball for my teammate. So I, I tell my stream all the time, like, you guys always got to challenge high, can't get faked as the first man, right? If I get faked there, then my teammate is defending a flip reset from five feet away from the net, right? It's just not not possible. Uh, whoa. Okay. I wait on... Oh, he, he's got that for sure. That's a goal. Yeah. That's gross. <laughs> um, you know, that, and that's another thing, too. Like, if it's a 1v1 scenario, yeah, you're supposed to just defend whatever shot you think is most likely to happen. Uh, but no, if you gotta... Bro, I really need to stop talking while I shoot open nets. That's my bad. Uh, I'm gonna just gonna try to demo him here. Should be a free ball for Silly Sasquatch. Yeah, dude, I swear when I just talk, I just lose. I just can't shoot. I can't, uh, do anything mechanical. Like, even remotely mechanical when I'm, when I'm talking. Hold on. Dude, like, if, I swear if I wasn't talking at the start of that, I would've just scored that immediately. I'm telling you guys. I'm telling you. He's got the ball, right? All right, I'm gonna shut up for this one. Oh, kind of a gross flip reset, but just was just going a little bit too high. I was hoping to like, you know, kind of get one of those flip resets that just like launches the ball. Um, but, you know, I was trying to just change the momentum of the ball with the flip reset rather than adding height to it. Uh, but unfortunately I just could not do that. Wait on him. His full boost here. Just 50 that high. Should be able to get that for free. Good beat. Over demo on him. Last guy's gonna be low boost now too, so nice. That's just a good shot. Yeah, as soon as I get that demo, it becomes a much, much easier situation for him, and that's gonna be the game. Alright, wait, I actually didn't get MVP this time, so I wonder what the celebration looks like now. He's not gonna give us the back double, is he? Oh yeah, look at him. He's getting the crowd hyped. Oh, man. Hey, it's a, it's a fun car, you know what I mean? It's not. It's probably not going to be my main car or anything like that, but it's fun. You know, and if you guys want to use the car, make sure to go to the item shop. Use code COCORL, and then go to the Transformers section, and uh, feel free to buy any of these, or uh, or all of them, if you'd like that. Uh, but anyways, if you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to like, comment, subscribe. We'll see you all in the next one. Peace.